So there's been a lot of uncertainty about the interest rates lately. Sellers are asking, why would I sell now? Buyers are holding off as well. What's up everybody, Brandon Cox with the New Home Collective, and we're back with another video. Our team has sold nearly 2,000 homes, and we got over 800 five-star Google reviews. Yes, over 800. So today, I'm sitting with the one and only Eric Kimball with Hometown Lenders, AKA Mr. Knowledge. So Eric, when I'm talking with sellers, I'm always hearing, Brandon, why in the world would I sell now when my rate is lower than what it would be if I bought? What advice would you give that individual? You know, we're getting that same question a lot on our side too. And the thought really comes into that you can possibly, you might be selling your house for a little bit less right now because there's not as many buyers. But coincidentally, most sellers are moving up in house. So you're gonna be buying a new house at a bigger discount too. And rates are gonna come back down. There's only one way the government can help control inflation and that's to raise rates. Well, there's only one way that the government can control and bring us down on a soft landing, that's the lower rates. Right. So sometime in the next you know, nine to 15 months, we're gonna start seeing this ease kind of start happening at the bottom. So you can kind of get the best of both worlds. You could buy a house a little bit cheaper right now and then refinance later in the year with a lower rate and you get a win-win. You get a house for lower and you get a lower rate. Right, right. Okay. Coincidentally, on a buyer's side, it's exactly the same math. So, so what advice would you give the buyers that right now are, they're hesitant and, cause we hear it all the time, just like mm -hmm. you do, man, like, look, I'm just gonna wait to see what happens. Right now, they could probably buy that house with less competition, you know, because you're not getting 25 offers on every house. Sure. You know, and first time home buyers are the hardest, you know, sector to break into housing because of the amount of competition there. So if you can buy a house right now when there's not as much competition, give your offer that extra edge that it needs to be able to get into the house, and then you can possibly refinance it on into the future, you've got a win-win as well. Boom, boom. Okay, so, it's hard when you're sitting here looking at these rates, but everybody's looking at them short term. Yes. And not looking at everything long term. Yes, yes. And there's actually some really good data out there that says that if somebody's in a position to make a move right now, they could really beat the market out on two ends. Well, I hope that eased some of your all's uncertainty. Give me a call today if you'd like to schedule a one-on-one -on -one call with Eric to discuss the options that you do have. Eric, man, I greatly appreciate you taking the time to be here today. I know you're extremely busy. And guys, as always, if you like the video, please let us know in the comments below. Thanks, man.